President Nelson wrote an article called The Everlasting Covenant, and he taught something that to me is one of the most powerful prophetic promises I've ever heard in my life. Once you and I have made a covenant with God, our relationship with him becomes much closer than before our covenant. Now we are bound together. Because of our covenant with God, he will never tire in his efforts to help us, and we will never exhaust his merciful patience with us. Each of us has a special place in God's heart. He has high hopes for us. And again, I think of the Lamanites, God working tirelessly across centuries and centuries, apparently without losing his patience. Yeah. Um, he didn't say, well, you guys have blown it yet again. I'm just done with you. I'm going to move on. He works with these people. Mm. President Nelson says he gives people opportunities to change. He's going to work with people no matter how long it takes and what he's got to do to entice and invite them back mm. so that when they are ready to use their agency to repent and exercise faith in Jesus Christ, they can experience all the blessings mm -hmm. of the covenant. And that's the message the Book of Mormon's trying to give us. It's so hopeful that we shouldn't be afraid. We should have hope in a loving Heavenly Father who is tireless in His efforts to bring all His children to Him.